So I'm embarking on this journey of understanding my energy and I just want to give a little update. <clears throat> so far what I can see is, is there's two things. Um, okay, really what it is, is when I'm in between things, I'm not doing something, there's a conversation going on in my head which makes me feel drained and tired. What's interesting is when I make these videos, the question of energy isn't, isn't there. Like I don't feel tired. Um, yeah, like even as I tune into myself now, there's th that, that question of energy, like lacking of energy is not even, like it's just non-existent. Um, which is which is interesting maybe maybe that's it maybe that's telling me something maybe that's telling me you know what my what i should be doing maybe uh i don't know so i guess i got a question for you and that is like what what activities do you do where for you you don't feel tired or you don't feel drained you know like what is it you when you're spending your time doing that thing, you get lost in it. Like time doesn't exist for you. You can just keep going. But also like what feels good as well. So for me, there's no feelings of like, there's no negative feelings associated with this. And I say that because when I play video games, for example, like time does go, but also there's like frustration and anger and it's like more about the competition of it all, right? So, yeah, a couple of things. This is like day seven now. And one thing that's come up for me is my impatience. You know, yesterday my energy didn't feel good during the day to the point where like I lacked motivation. I didn't want to do much. And um, I decided to go back to bed and I went to bed for like an hour and then like motivation came back. But also I'm noticing this pattern of when I actually listen to myself and I list, list, give myself what I need, when I ask myself, how am I? It's like, okay, I'm anxious or, um, yeah, like what I need is just to not do work or stuff. So that tells me like I need a break. And when I take that break, what comes up is emotion. Like sadness, I've cried a couple of times this week. And I know that as well, I've noticed this pattern with me the last four years or since I've become more sensitive. Whenever I feel stressed, it's because I'm suppressing sadness usually. Like a good cry releases that stress. But what happens is, is I become so busy, not focusing on myself, just working in the outer world, doing things, being busy, that all of a sudden, before I know it, I've neglected myself to a point where it's just that I'm not appreciating a certain emotional aspect of myself. I'm not allowing myself to feel certain emotions, whether that's like grief, mourning, loss, abandonment, whatever it is. So being in this journey, understanding my energy, when I tune into my energy and there's some blocks to it, I face those blocks and crying has happened. I understand like it's crying like more cathartic, but also with no drama, no suffering attached. Like the feeling that I want to cry comes up and I allow it. And then, you know, 10 minutes later, 15 minutes later, I'm fine again. So energy, I mean, Obviously, I've got 30 days to go. I still would say my energy is like a five out of 10. Today, I feel a bit better. Maybe I'd give myself a six. But definitely yesterday. Yesterday was more like a four. Because, you know, I got to the point where I even had to go back to bed. So what I'm saying is, is that the early night sleep isn't, hasn't had that effect I was looking for. And that's really then caused me to become a bit frustrated yesterday. Because... I expected this change. But then a uh, friend and client of mine, she reminded me like, uh, like, you know, it reminds me of 
because of my background is in personal training when I used to have clients come to me and say oh, I want to lose weight so I put them on a program and then seven days later they come back and say oh it's not working it's rubbish blah 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 like dude relax it's been seven days <laughs> it's kind of what I'm doing with this whole journey and sleep thing right or the 30 days of early nights so that's been interesting but I have noticed uh, my internal strength is starting to improve. So I can really feel the correlation between me having a good bedtime routine and me feeling internally stronger. I do feel like my systems are coming back online and powering up again. So yeah, I'm excited to keep going for the rest of the time, for the rest of the 30 days at least. And um, there definitely has been health benefits, but in terms of like mental clarity and uh, just this feeling of energy, whatever that is, or, or understanding my energy, there hasn't been that correlation yet. So just a little update about where I'm at, what I'm experiencing. And um, yeah, it's been interesting so far. We'll keep going. Peace, love and prosperity. Take care of yourself.